See in here. But when it came to one specific question, Cohen said that he wasn't allowed to answer the question. In the process, Cohen revealed that the SDNY is criminally targeting someone really close to Donald Trump. Michael Cohen was asked about the last time he heard from Donald Trump or from someone representing Donald Trump. Cohen said he couldn't remember the precise date, but acknowledged that it was roughly in the fall of 2017, two months after the FBI had raided Cohen's office. When Cohen was asked about the specifics of that conversation, that's when Cohen suddenly decided he couldn't address the matter. Cohen has been revealing Donald Trump's crimes all day, so there is no reason he wouldn't be able to reveal Trump's role in this post-raid conversation. The only possible explanation here is that the SDNY is criminally targeting the person whom Trump sent to talk to Cohen. This in turn means that Trump sent the person to deliver a message to Cohen that was criminal in nature. Was it a bribe? Was it a threat? The big question is who Donald Trump sent to have this illegal conversation with Michael Cohen. We don't know, but Trump obviously would have sent someone really close to him who could be trusted to handle it and keep it quiet. This confirms that the SDNY is actively targeting at least one person in Trump's inner circle. There are probably a whole lot more.